Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to all of our wonderful and juicy and delicious little subscribers out there. And how I love you all so, and I hope that you're all super duper well, super duper wonderful and super duper delicious. And that life is treating you oh so deliciously wherever you are in the world. So, so much love to you all, my delicious little baby, six kisses and good morning, good afternoon, good evening to any passers by. And I hope that you too are having a super duper and delicious time wherever you are in the world. So one kiss to you, my delicious little babies, and thank you for joining. Okay, so three, two, one. Oh, there we go. Came on straight away today, my juicy little lads. Thank you, little lads. You're lovely and bright. Oh, they are lovely and bright, aren't they, my delicious little babies? Now then, if you do enjoy the uh, video today, if you could please click on the like. For others of you, please feel free to subscribe. Um, please feel free to comment if you wish to comment as well. It's all welcomed. And please and thank you, thank you, thank you. Now then, our weather in our old neck of the woods in the old UK. Yes, it's a little bit windy, um, a little bit chilly. Um but it's dry okay that's just in my neck of the woods it could be differing in other places okay my delicious little babies yes so now then uh let's have a talk shall we so i've seen something this morning and it is what does it say what did it say it said uh stop wanting start accepting I'm just wondering what you think about that matter, the sticker babies. Stop wanting, start accepting. So if we look at this in one way, Mad delicious little babies that you are out right there, okay? And I hope that you're all super duper well, my delicious little babies. Yes, it's bank holiday uh, Monday today in our Nick Woods in the old UK. Uh, so yes, and then I do believe I think are we having a, a day off for um, for the fight king? I believe we're doing that as well. Anyway, let me get back to something uh, more interesting. So, um, so yes. So if we look at this in one way, okay, because. With me, I like to look at different angles. Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious little babies? Yes. So if we look at this in one way, yes, we could say, okay, because we've had this, like uh, what I call a prison, uh, that we all seem to be um, caged into, okay, that have created and the putrid little lackeys, okay? Uh, well, it's sort of created a world, hasn't it, yes? Well, for most uh, parts of the world, you know, you, you do seem to have a few um, parts, you know, elsewhere uh, where there's just no greed at all. Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious babies, yes? But what it is, is that it's being created so that, you know, it's like, oh, you know, so I'm just using the examples now, my delicious little babies, yes? And this goes on, it's been going on for decades, okay? So it could be, somebody could be up the road, down the road, round the bend, you know, they could have a car or they could have a house or they could have whatever they have. And then instead of somebody else, say, walking past, and, and sometimes it can be to do with friendships as well. There we are. It can be to do with friendships as well, yes? So they say to themselves, oh, you know, well, why has so-and-so got that? Do you see what I'm saying? I want that. Do you see what I'm saying? I'm sure that for most of you delicious and beautiful little babies out there that you're going to get where I'm coming from, there's, well, I mean, I've met quite a few in my, there we are in my lifetime. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Sa do you see what I'm saying? Sorry, yes. Um, and for most of you, delicious little babies, you would have met somebody in your life where they've wanted what you've got. There we are, do you see? Okay. Now, sometimes it could be that, you know, you have very little, but uh, they still want what you've got. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. I mean, 
sometimes, I mean, as well as material things, which um, does seem to play a very large part in all of this, okay? Uh, sometimes it could simply be somebody's personality. Do you see what I'm saying? So you could have somebody who's, um, shall we just say, well, you know, mimicking, there we are, mimicking somebody else. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, so, uh, so they want to be like, I mean, sometimes it can be an admiration thing. Can it not? Yes, it can. You know, sometimes somebody could admire somebody else and think, wow, you know, he or she you know, has a very large outgoing personality or something, yes, okay, yes. Uh, and other times it could be very sadly the other way, you know, the other uh, way where, you know, you could have where, say, somebody would have just wanted to be downright nasty. There we go, and I've met a rather a lot of those in my uh, time. That's why... Ah, delicious little babies out there. I only have a very small circle, circle, circle. And my beautiful, dear, and wonderful lady friends. Do you see what I mean? I keep my circle very close. You see what I'm saying? Because you have an awful lot out there who are not so nice. I can assure you of that now. Mad, delicious little babies. But of course, you know, I steered away from that, uh, there we go, many years ago. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, because, you know, you see what the crack somebody's at and you say to yourself, no, I'm not a liking. I do not want you in my company. You know, you're, you're not very nice. Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious little babies? And there's plenty of those and there still is now. But... When we look at the material world, okay, my delicious little babies, yes. Well, well, it is true in a way, isn't it? If we look at this, you know, at one angle of things, yes, where, you know, it's like wants, wants ma and ma and ma. Do you see? It's like... I don't know. I mean, say, for example, you know, you could get businessmen. Do you see what I mean? Of course, you know, uh, decades ago, you know, I was around businessmen for nearly 10 years. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. Uh, but it's just, it, it's what I call, it's like a hunger. Do you see what I mean? It's like a hunger. Yes. Like, I must get that. ka -ching! Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. And then, of course... They just want to make ma and ma and ma. So they're wanting, wanting, wanting. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, I mean, please do not get me wrong. I mean, you know, they were very six. There we go. They were very successful in what they did. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, wheeling and dealing, ducking and a diving, if you get me. Mad delicious little babies, yes. But I never met a poor one. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. So... If we look at that side of things, yes, then it's always wanting, isn't it? It's like, okay, let's give another example. All I'm doing today, I'm just having a little talk, okay, for a dummy readings, okay? Uh, but what I'm wanting to do is give food for thought today. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. It's like, say, for example, you could have somebody who wants a car. You know, I'm simply just giving examples here, yes? So you could have somebody who, you know... They've got, they've already got a car, yes? And then, of course, they see something else, something else catches their eye, and then and then they say to themselves, right, well, I, I, well I'm not happy with the car that I've got. I want uh, a, that car that they've seen. Do you see what I'm saying? So that is what I would call another way of wanting, isn't it? Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious little babies, yes? But if they were just to say to themselves, okay, well, I've got my wheels, I've got my car, it's working perfectly well, there's no issues with my car. I'm just giving examples, my delicious little babies, yes? Uh, so really, I do not need another car. Okay, another example is um, uh, mobile phones. 
do you see? Especially, um, it seems, with these younger generations, I just need to have a sip of my coffee, please, and thank, thank, thank you. You know, like when we look at the younger generations, like, uh, and of course, you know, it goes on in schools, doesn't it? I mean, this is this has gone on a long time, hasn't it? My delicious little babies, you know, where you've got one and, you know, maybe they've got a, you know, dog and burn, you know, and it could be, do you know what I mean? Like a very new type of uh, make, yes? And of course, you know, and then they see one of their mates or associates, you know, and then they've got a, an even more up-to-date dog and burn. Do you see what I'm saying? So then what then happens is, is that the one who's has, you know, the one who's got the fern, sorry, um, that's not as high graded as the other one, yes. Well then, you know, then it's like, oh, well I, well, I want to phone the same. Do you see what I'm saying to you, yes? And this is what's being created. And this is what's being created like with, uh, well, it could be anything really. It could be uh, furniture, you know, it could be paintings, pictures, could be um, jewellery, could be, um, well, of course, the obvious, you know, which I said was cars, you know, which, of course, you know, they're trying to get off the road, okay? But they can still drive. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, yes, one rule for one and one rule for another. Do you see what I'm saying? Um, but this is what we have, isn't it? Do you see? And this is with technology. Do you see? Like, so the sooner, say, for example, parents, I'm only giving an example, my little babies, yes? And, of course, it happens with adults as well, you know, so it's across the board, yes? Well, by the time that they've saved up, you know, I mean, some would, you know, need to get credit or something like this, yes. But uh, others, by the time they've saved up, they thought, oh, you know, my hard-earned uh, ka you know, from working. And then they go and purchase for them. Well, then, as soon as do they purchase that dog and burn, well, then the new upgraded comes out. Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious babies? Yes, I'm hoping that... Um, that, well, for all of you actually, my delicious little babies, that you're following what I'm saying here. So it's that, it's that want, isn't it? It's like that, um, and if it's if it's not like I want, it's like, oh, well, I really need that. I really need that item. Do you see what I'm saying to you, my delicious little babies? Yes. But then... What quite often happens is, my little babies, yes, is that once somebody gets what they want, yes, it's like, say, for even say it, it's like a temporary fix. It's like a fix. It's like somebody, God bless them, because, I mean, of course, you know, we've got hundreds upon hundreds of uh, addictions in the world, it seems. But what I'm saying to you is, is quite simply these simple things, yes? It's like somebody with an addiction. So it could be anything, it could be drugs, yes? Uh, just as an example. But once they've had a, a puffy puffy, you know, of a, the old wacky backy or something like this, yes? Once they've had that, it's like a temporary high, isn't it? And then, uh, of course, you know, uh, sometimes, which I have seen over my uh, decades, where, um, you know, it can, can be like, like, sorry, a little bit of a crash down to earth. I keep stumbling on this video for some reason. Okay, there we go. I'm cold here. So what I'm saying to you is, my delicious little babies, is that, uh, you know, you know, you go out... You buy something, right? But it's only temporary. Are you following what I'm saying to my delicious little babies, yes? And then it's like, then you say to yourself, oh, you know, well, I've had that a little while. Well, now I want, so there we go. Now I want something else. Do you see what I'm saying to you, yes? And this is everything that's being created. 
You say, do you say? So it's uh, I want, I need, I must have. There we go, that's another one. Do you say? Okay, so we've been put into this, I feel, uh, as man and woman, we have been put into this um, situation. Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious little babies? Yes. And of course, it's created division. It's created um, a lot of competition. It's created a lot of greed. Do you see what I'm saying? Yes. I mean, it's like here. That's just coming to me old noddle. Let's uh, give another example, shall we? Let's look at... Um, you know, like say, um, you, you know, like the gold um, medals, you know, like when they're doing the Olympics and things like this, yes. And of course, you know, the, you know, God bless them, you know, they're all training, 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 you know, because they want to win, don't they? Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious babies, yes? So they're so desperate to win. But even with that, you can have... One who, you know, would get uh, the gold, yes? And then you'll get someone who gets the silver and you'll get somebody who gets the bronze. But deep down, uh, nine times out of ten, so correct me if I'm wrong here, which I do not believe I am, okay? That the one who's got the silver really wanted the gold, and the one who's got the bronze really wanted the silver. Do you, do you, there we go. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. Instead of just being happy with what they got. Here we are. Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious babies? Yes. So it means that we're living in a world with such a lot of greed such a lot of and it, it is really it is height there we are there we are so it's like there's so much height there we go Oof. can't say and we all of us our delicious babies we did not create this Somebody else made it. There we are. That's why. Do you see? So when I look at the other side of stop wanting, you know, just accept. Yes. So if we look at it one way, we can see it from one angle, but then we can see it from a different angle. So I'm looking at two angles here, two sides. Do you see? So if we just stopped wanting, like I want this, I want that, I want the other, it's like, it's like a young bairn, yes, a young child, yes, I just call them bairns and then, you know, others will call them a uh, child or children, yes. What, it, it, for most of you, my delicious babies, you would have seen it, do you know what I mean? It could, you could have friends, little bairns, you could have um, your nieces, nephews, you know, Grandsons, granddaughters, cousins, bands. Do you see what I mean? Yes. And what do they do when they go into a shop, especially a sweetie shop? Oh, can I have this? So if they're with their mommy or daddy, can I have this? I seen it just the other day. I mean, there was a little, a little bairn and she was uh, in a push chair. Yes. And she was squealing her little head off. And I will say that. I mean, she was about, what, two, two and a half. And she was squealing her little head off until her mum got her one of these, you know, like these little kinder egg things, yes? And I took a look and I thought, do you know, and I can honestly say, hand on heart, that none of my uh, beautiful little daughters and how I love them so, how I love you so, never behave that way. Simply because my delicious little babies, yes, as much as I love all little bands, you know, they are a blessing, okay? And they go through their terrible twos and they go through their tantrums and you have the, the teenage years and then they go through that as well. Some, God bless them, worse than others, okay? Um, 
But as I can honestly say that I would never in a million years have tolerated any of my daughters, my beautiful little daughters doing that or making a holy show of me in a shop. Not a chance. Just would not have been happening. And I certainly would not have rewarded with a kinder egg. Do you see what I'm saying? You know, I would have been very polite. But, you know, I would have said no. You cannot have it. Now, please behave and thank you. Do as you're told. You see, I was brought up very strictly, yes? So my young Ben's, they were never like that. I can honestly say, hand on heart, there wasn't. Do you see what I'm saying? They could have something if they wanted it. Do you see what I'm saying? But getting back to this, so some may call me a strict mother. Well, fine. Do you see what I mean? I call it not dragging me bands up. I call it bringing them up correctly. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, so that they do not get this greediness uh, into their systems and that they grow up with the greediness do you see? Okay, because that's what it's about. But, you know, I've seen it over my decades. You know, the second mothers or fathers going to a shop and the, the, the little bands are, I want this, I want this, I want this. Do you see? And very rarely are there any manners like please or thank you. It's like they'll just snatch. Do you see? There we are, see. Do you see what I'm saying? She wants to baby. Yes, so that's what it's uh, like. But it's uh, like it as adults as well. Except for the difference is it's not like sweeties or a piece of cake or, you know, you're talking uh, major ka you know, mass, you know, massive um, houses and uh, who's got the largest car and who's got the more, the more expensive car. Do you see? So it comes down to greed, but instead of accepting, I mean, how many, I mean, unless you're making a family together, yes? Let's look at this in, in a, a different angle as well. Say you could have a couple, okay? And say, I don't know, for argument's sake. I'm using it as an example, by the way, okay? And they could have been living in a one-bedroom flat. And then, of course, you know, then comes along the maid decides to get, you know, beautiful, oh, beautiful little baby, little animals, you know, a little, um, I don't know what to call them, little doggy, but little doggies or little pussy cats, she said to me. And then they may decide, oh, oh, thank you, my beautiful dear little spirit. Did you see that then? Oh, how I love you, sir. Um, and then the maid decide then and think, oh, well, you know, oh, we've been together a while, so, you know, let's start a family. You see, there we go. Yes, I'm cold here, yes. So even if nobody clicks on of you, you know, there'll be somebody somewhere, could take months, but this will relate to somebody, do you see? And then they say to themselves, oh, you know, well, let's go and find somewhere bigger. Or they could have just had a baby and think, oh, let's go and find somewhere bigger, larger, yes? So then they're there and then you've got the three, then they've got a two bedroomed. Do you see what I'm saying? And they could still only have one bed, one child, but then they're there for a, a few years, and then they say, well, let's go and uh, upgrade, let's go and get a three-bedroomed. Do you see? Which, uh, nine times out of ten, is going to cost them more ka in rent or mortgage, okay, unless they can afford to pay straight cash, which I do not know many who can do that personally, yes? But then, so what they're actually doing is, they're, well, how's the best way to put this now? They're creating um, a larger problem for themselves. There we are. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. So when we look at the wording, stop wanting, just accept. Do you see? So if we look at this a different way, we could say, yes, stop wanting this, that and the other. Stop being greedy. There we go. Stop your greed. Okay. Accept things the way, the way that they are. 
and just accept that, you know, this is the way it is at this moment in time. In other words, what I'm getting at, there we are. For even say it's more cold, it live in the present. There we are. But it just seems that it's like we're all here, okay? Because, I mean, obviously, you know, we were brought here by our wonderful mothers and fathers, do you see what I'm saying to you, yes? You know, and for those of us who are still here, we're meant to be here for this time that we're meant to be here for. Do you see what I'm saying to you, yes? So therefore in itself, it's a blessing, isn't it? For us all to be here. Do you see? But, you know, I see, when I seen that wording, I thought, well, yes. You know, we could look at this two ways. There we are. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. So, you know, and some some out there go crazy. I just got crazy. They go crazy. It's like they have to have, there we are. They have to have so many things, but it's only a quick fix. It's only temporary. There we are. Do you see? It's like so many now very sadly just get easily bored there we are do you see and when you actually look around i'm not saying this about everybody no but when you look around i just see it as rather sad so, so maybe maybe if we look at it another way maybe maybe we should just stop wanting all the time you know, and just accept, you know, just sort of living, well, not sort of, living in the present and just accepting things as, you know, as they are, you know, at the time, yes? And then when you're ready to make a change, there we go, then you can make that change. But I just feel that there's so many who want to run before they walk. There we are. So, yes, it was very interesting. You know, when you actually look really, really, really closely at words, do you say, what does it really mean? Do you know what I mean? You could say, I want ice cream. I want an ice cream. I want some chocolate. I want a new woman, I want a new man. <laughs> you could say so many things. I want a new car. I want a new house. I want 10 chickens in my, in my back garden. Do, do you see what I'm saying? It stretches so far. Do you see what I'm saying? But if we just lived in this world where we just accepted or even accepted ourselves. I mean, I accept myself. You know, I mean, I mean, I'm not perfect by any stretch of the imagination, but I accept myself. You know, I love my body. I love who I am. You know, I look at myself with the old portraits in the mirror and I think, you know, you're not a bad looking bird. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Yes. Okay. Even though I'm nearly 50. Anyway, well, anyway, that's still young, isn't it? But... What I'm saying to you is, it's all about accepting, isn't it? Uh, then you've got others where it's like, oh, I want surgery. I want Botox. There we go. Thank you, my beautiful dear little spirit, say. I want surgery. I want these pumped up or I want that pumped up or... Jesus and said, I want these pumped up. Oh, mind you, I've seen one that went been dreadfully wrong, actually. The other week, oh dear, had the old, um, what did I call them? Lip fillers. <gasps> you should have seen her. It was like flipping, a pair of flipping balloons instead of a flipping mouth. <sighs> Deary me. You know. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. And you have to feel sorry sometimes. You really, really do, you know. I mean, what is it about themselves that they really just do not like? You never see me go under the knife. 
you know, do not mean that in the wrong way, by the word, by, by the way, sorry, my delicious little baby is calling that now, if you know what I mean. But uh, no, never see a man go under, no. Because if we cannot, and that's each and every one of us, my delicious little babies, if we cannot accept ourselves for who we are, yes, I mean, you're going to have some delicious uh, little babies out. I'll keep stumbling on this video, you know. And today I was actually going to talk about, there we go, something else, but I don't know what's going on here. And I'm going to stand by this now. I am. Okay. This will uh, apply to somebody out there. Okay. Maybe whoever you are, my delicious little baby, maybe you're not liking who you are or there's something you're not accepting. Whether you are a man or a woman. But really, I mean, I cannot tell you what to do, whoever you are, my delicious baby. But what I can say is, or babies, but what I can say is, you know, sometimes you have to learn to accept, there we are, who you are and what you have in your life. You know, some can have so little, and I've met many, but guess what? They're the flipping happiest you'll ever flipping meet. There we are. And then I met ones where, you know, they're in massive, colossal uh, houses and they're not happy at all. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. So I just thought that was really interesting. I mean, there's others of you delicious little babies out there where you may just find this video boring. Well, I'm sorry that you feel that way and thank you for watching up until this point. But if you do not like it, skip my channel, move from it. I'm not really interested. And that's not being nasty. My interest is my beautiful and delicious little baby subscribers and also anyone who has a, a certain level up there in their old noddle, okay, to understand what I'm getting across. There we are. Do you see? That's what I'm uh, saying. You know, maybe if we just said to ourselves, not myself, no, but maybe for, for some delicious little babies, not all, okay? And I must just stress that, yes? But for some, you know, if they just stop saying to themselves, you know, oh, I do not like my, uh, <laughs> I don't, it's just one of my beautiful uh, dear neighbours up the road, God bless them. Right, anyway, um, sorry about that, I don't get distracted. Um, yes, I mean, maybe if they just stop saying to themselves, do you see what I mean? I want this, I want that, I want the other. I'm not happy with my body, so I've got to go out and do this. There we are. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, maybe if they stop doing that, or maybe if they stop saying, oh, I want this house, I want that, I want this. Do you see what I'm saying? I want that jewellery. Do you see what I'm saying? Yes. I actually genuinely believe that uh, for most would be, there we go, if I even say it, would be happier. Do you see? That's my thoughts. But if you imagine, you know, I did another short video. Was it last week? Could be. Um, you know, what life would be uh, like just to, you know, no greed, no hatred, no enviness. You know, no green-eyed monster. You know, I want what you want. Nah, 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 nah. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah, there we go. So, you know, if we just stopped all of this, I genuinely, honestly, hand on heart, feel that life would be so much better. There we are. Do you see? But this is what's been uh, created. So... Really, I feel that this is really, really spiritual. Do you see what I'm saying to my delicious little babies? Yes, it's, and I, and I do genuinely feel that we are going through a very, I feel, myself anyway, because I am spiritual anyway, my delicious little babies, for those of you so very kindly, and God love you, another two kisses there, you know, that being so kind to follow me for all this time, you know. You've seen all my different modes. <laughs> anyway, but uh, sometimes I'm very, there we go, very passionate about things. But uh, I just feel that 
we're going through a very spiritual time at the moment. Uh, and we are having some delicious little babies out there, you know, who are, you know, starting to learn more about themselves. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, and I, I see that as a beautiful thing, actually. Do you see? Because, you know, you have to be able to know yourself, okay? And then, like, this morning, just before I came onto the uh, camera, to talk to you all, my delicious little babies, and thank you so very much once again. Well, two kisses, thank you, thank you, thank you. Well, and then what did I say? So I've seen another um, video, I never clicked on it, by the way, I never clicked, I, well, I do not feel the flipping need to click on it, to be perfectly honest with you. I mean, others out there, delicious little babies, well, you know, everybody needs help with something, yes, there we go, so, you know. But what was it? So many ways, I cannot remember it all now, I'm mean, just trying to remember just in my noddle. So many ways to, um, on what to do with your time, you know, uh, if you're feeling lonely, you know, spending time alone. Oh. I thought to myself, this is just me personally, my delicious little babies, yes? I'm not speaking for anybody else here, okay? This is just my own uh, personal views, so it's my own views, yes? Oh, I, I genuinely do not feel that I need to uh, look at a video to tell me what to do with my time, you know, if I'm on my own. There's plenty of things, there we go, to flipping do when you're on your own. I do not feel the need to look at a video to tell me that. There we go. Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes. But can you see what's gone on here? It's like, you know, we've got, uh, what have we got? We've got um, psychologists. We've got therapists we've got what else we've got we've got agony aunts we've got um psychiatrists and when you actually look at it in reality do we need all of these professions i'm not being nasty to anybody my delicious little baby she's the question that I'm asking is, do we need all of these different professions? It's just a question. I've noticed over many years, yes, and the decades, yes, that, uh, and actually I have spoken, there we go, and I've spoken to a number in my decades, yeah, there we go, okay, they absolutely, and this is both man and woman, my delicious little babies, yes, they have absolutely despised being on their own, yes, it's like they just cannot spend that time on their own but i feel that it is so important for each and every one of us to have there we go our alone time everybody should because you have to get to know yourself you have to you know, you may want to do things, you may want to, do you see what I mean? Whether it's inside the home, whether it's outside the home, do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes, but you see, I'm, in, I'm just going to cut to the chase, yes, and we'll get straight to the point. What it is, they're afraid of being, there we are, on their own because they're afraid of their own thoughts. So, to keep themselves busy, I've heard a lot of this, there we are, over the decades, yes? So, to keep themselves busy, okay? Just to stay busy, 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 Lizzie, okay? Uh, like a busy bee, okay? Well, the thing is, is that um, it means that they do not have to think. Do you see? 
Do you see what I'm saying to you? Yes? It's like, have you ever actually stood there and looked at a, I don't know, could be anything, a flower, could be a tree, and actually just stood there just looking at it and just thought, oh, where do you come from? What family of flowers do you come from? Or what family of trees do you come from? There we go, right? Because I'm very much into this kind of thing anyway, right? But just to look at, and like little bees, uh, and I do, uh, I, I do believe actually listening uh, to a video the other day, that they are, uh, God bless, killing little, beautiful little bees in Australia. Only according to what I heard, my delicious little babies, only according to what I'd heard. How wicked is that? Anyway, but even looking at a beautiful little bee, you know, and just taking the time instead of just walking straight past, you know, just watching and watching, you know, when they go into the little bushes and things or go onto the flowers and just taking that time just to stand and watch what these beautiful, what we've been sent on this earth, what they can do. There we are. Do you say? But I've got to be honest, I do not know many, and that's not being wicked to anybody who I know, but I do not know many who actually stand and take that time to do that. Do you see? So, yes, I just feel that there's so many, well, it's not what I feel, it's what I know. To be on their own, okay, it's like they, they say, oh, I think, oh, I've got to think about this, then I've got to think about that. Do you see? Instead of just letting it go, you know, and sometimes with situations, you know, depending on what it is, of course, you know, I mean, if it's really, really bad, well, of course, it's common sense. You have to come out of that situation, you know, common sense to prevail would tell you that. Do you see what I mean? If, if there's any, you know, physical way you can get out of it, yes. But for most, uh, do you know what I'm saying to you, yes? So this is all that I'm, you know, saying. You know, I just do not feel that so many out there should be afraid of being alone and spending that time with their, their own selves. You say? That's all I wanted to say, really. Nothing else to say. Please say your prayers as well, will you please, my delicious little babies, for these beautiful little uh, creatures, great and small, little bees and everything, and what they're doing around the world. There we go. Just no need for it, is there really? One more sip of my coffee, please, and thank, thank, thank you. And one last thing just before I go. Oh, thank you, my beautiful dear little spirit. Yes, uh, super duper brat. <laughs> um, just one more thing. Yes, I went to go and see the beautiful little baby girl last night. Oh, I had a wonderful time. Oh, so beautiful, so tiny. And it's like she's as, as small as she was, okay? Uh, it's like she, you know, I don't know, it's because they're very spiritual little uh, babies. Do you see what I'm saying? Ever so spiritual, yes? And it's like, you know, we talk, I was talking with a beautiful mommy and daddy as well, you know. And you say certain things and the little eyes went, bing! Do you see what I mean? You know, with a little dummy like. Do you see what I'm saying? And that's as little as what you're all. She had the most tiny, tiny, tiny little hands and tiny, tiny little feet. Oh, she was super duper gorgeous and delicious. I said to her beautiful dear mummy and daddy, I said, oh, she's your beautiful little princess. I says, she's beautiful, wonderful and delicious. I said, and she's my little princess. And they said, oh, this is, will you just wait? This is because we'll be bringing her down. I said, that's all right. I said, bring her down to me. I said, no worry at all. I looked after enough bairns in my lifetime. Do you see what I mean? So it wouldn't bother me if they ever asked me. Do you see what I'm saying to her? You know, what I'm saying to you, sorry, my delicious little babies, it'll be a pleasure. You know, it's nice to just have a little uh, laugh running around, you know, running after them. <laughs> you know what I mean? Keep, keeps you flipping feet, I'm telling you. They keep you busy, no joke. And anybody would know with little toddlers, they're not saying that against any dear women or dear ladies who've had problems or ex terrible 
awful situations or experiences, you know. And may we say a prayer for God bless them all, you know, who've been going through very hard times. Anyway, so that was um, the video, my delicious babies. So, you know, thank you so very much for listening. Just, just a little natter, really. That's all I wanted to say, really. Just food for thought, isn't it? But I do feel that we're going through a spiritual, and there are a large number who are going through an awakening. There we go at the moment. You know, it's just, just finding themselves, isn't it? Do you see what I'm saying? She might have little babies, yes. But, you know, it'll come good. It'll come good. There we are. I always have a positive mental attitude as well, okay? And I am cold here, so there will be some goodness, okay? It's just we have to go through the flipping crap first, the sharp first, okay? So until my next video, please continue to lift the vibration and lift the frequency, okay? Please take care of yourselves, my delicious babies, and please try and take care of others, okay, if they need your help. And please give a pat on the back, a shake of the old hand, to some of your family members, some of your friends, and some of your work colleagues, then please tell them that they're wonderful, juicy, beautiful, and delicious, and that you love them so. And once again, thank you for listening, my little babies, okay? Some of you may just see me as rambling on. I was stumbling now on this video, because I can have many videos where I do not stumble once. So I'm feeling that, uh, there we go, this is going to be for somebody. Do you see what I'm, There we are. It is. But it's just whatever I was meant to be talking about has not quite gone that way. It just wasn't meant to, that's all. And of course, so what do I do? I accept. There we go. I accept that what I was supposed to talk about, I've talked about something else. Do you see what I'm saying? So that's accepting, isn't it? So I'm accepting what I've been given to talk about, do you see? And I'm not wanting to change my video to you all now, do you see? I just feel that we just need to look closer at words, just there we are, closer at a, a, a lot of these things, yes? But I definitely believe that there needs to be many, many, many more, God bless them, to go back into nature. That's, that's, there we are. That's my real strong feelings here. Words and uh, nature. Okay, to leave the video. Now, until my next video, my delicious little babies, so much love to you all, okay? God bless you, okay? And wherever you are in the world, have a beautiful morning, afternoon or evening, wherever you are. I hope it's super duper special for each and every one of you. Okay, who's even taken the time to even watch me today? Okay, so so much love. God bless. Till my next videos. Thank you. Goodbye.